Hey guys, so it's been like about a week since we came back from Vegas and I've been trying to do a haul video on the big bag of goodies that I got from Ross while I was there and I haven't been able to because of work but I finally have the time now so let's do it. And I'm also sick so I'll try to ignore my stuffy voice and if you see my nose red every once in a while it's because I've been like blowing it and stuff. So first is this one. And I'm very excited about it because it has a Michael Kors. I don't know why I'm making my voice weird. I'm tired. <laughs> but it was a comparable value of 208 and I got it for 129 So that's pretty good. It's still expensive, but I mean, you can expect that because it is Michael Kors. My favorite color is Royal Blue and I'm really glad that I found one like this. There was another one that had the exact same design, but instead of being dark blue, it was like a burgundy. And like, I'm alright with burgundy, but I saw this one, I'm like, oh, I have to have it. So this is what it looks like from the side. I kind of didn't like that it's not like a zipper like all the way through because there's like a middle part to this and there's like open flaps so to me that's kind of very like unsecure but I figured you know what whatever like it's really cute the cool thing is that it could turn into like a crossbody this is actually its little keychain see looks 10 times better right and I haven't even opened it so it's actually very wide from the inside and that's what I wanted. I've been having very small purses for like the longest time and I'm getting very frustrated because the older I'm getting the more crap I have in my bags. So here it is. Here's a little salt bag it comes with. Oh and it has like the actual Michael Kors tag. $2.98 almost $300 guys and we got it for fucking Comparable value my ass. This wasn't 200. This was 300 boy. I got it for 130 and it used to be 300. That's crazy. Now I'm even more happy I got it. And it comes with its little booklet. Like that's pretty authentic, right? What I do like about the middle part is that it's, you know, obviously beige from the inside and it has a pocket over here and another pocket over here. I can fit all the way up to like my wrist in here and the other big pockets look like this and same thing if I like fold my hand I can fit up to like almost like my forearm wrist area. So for starters, this sweater that I'm wearing here, I also got it from Ross. I like that it has like little buttons over here. You can't really see it right now, but it has like a collar right here. Unfortunately though, it doesn't have pockets at the bottom, but that's okay because like for like a kind of thin sweater, it's like pretty warm. And what I really like about this is that it covers my butt all the way down here so my butt doesn't get cold. And I also wanted to share this with you guys. There are these gorgeous kind of like Toy Story woody looking boots. <laughs> they look like this. It makes me want to like just write Andy on the sole of this boot. <laughs> I feel like it's like it's perfect. It's even light brown so you'll be able to see it. But I really like that it's a very chunky heel and it's very soft, very cushiony from like on these parts and it also has like memory foam. This was from Target and it was $39.99 and honestly a very good price for like such a beautiful boot and the reason that why I got these is because I'm planning a very special Wanda video for you guys. Next I got some shorts and these are like kind of like high-waisted and these were only $13.99 and it says it is eco-friendly fabric. I don't really care about that but I mean if you do that's you know you should get these. What mainly draws me to these is that they're very soft, like they're not like that thick jean material. And I got this gray hoodie over here. And then this one is actually very warm. In the past, I've gotten some sweaters from Forever 21 and they're not even soft in the inside. They feel like a towel from the inside. And this one was only $14.99. <laughs> I've been having this bag here just sitting in my room for like way too long. And I've been wanting to use the like, clothes, but I keep saying, no, 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 I should just 
do the haul video first and then I'll then I could finally use the clothes. So I'm like, you know what, the day has come and I'm really looking forward to using the new robe that I got. So, cause I don't have any clean robes right now, so I'm really excited, but of course I'm gonna have to wash it first, right? Next is this orange top right here. That's kind of like scrunched up at the bottom with like two ties or like strings, I mean. And this one was $7.99. Next are pants that I got for work. These are like, you know, typical yoga pants. Last time I did get these in a size small, but this time I got them in a medium because they do tend to shrink because they're cotton. I liked that this one has pockets on the sides and it is almost like a boot cut towards the bottom. They like to have us wear slacks at work, which I hate because I feel like they're uncomfortable, but I bold the system because I started to think, you know what? Yoga pants look the same like slacks. So, and they're more comfortable. So I'm gonna start wearing those and nobody has said anything to me to this day. Hopefully they won't say anything ever. <laughs> These are $12.99 and I wish I would have found more, but unfortunately that was like the only pair. So hopefully I'll find some at my Ross here in California, but. I love the Ross at Vegas in front of the Circus Circus because that one is always packed with like the best stuff. And next, I've always wanted like a leather jacket because they look cool. And I got this one for $36.99. The only downside is that it has like suede sleeves. But other than that, it's fine. And then it just has like some gold zipper detailings. And then on the back, it's uh, like the fake leather too. It's just like on the sleeves that it has like the suede. This was a robe I was talking to you guys about. Not only is it very thick and very purple, it's also a Calvin Klein. Sir Calvin sells this for 78 bucks and I got it for 30. And this, um, totally unrelated but I actually did get this beanie from Forever 21 like a week before I went to Vegas and it was a very cute Kuropi one. I don't know I've never seen this like cartoon whatever it is but I, I don't know I just saw the little face and I just think it's funny and cute so I liked it and this is how it looks and while I'm talking to you guys about the little frog I also got the shirt and it, I like that it's like green because I feel like I don't really have a lot of green things. But what I love about this the most is that it has the little cute little Kuropi buttons. Next is a black cardigan. These are always an essential. It has colored buttons and I like that it has pockets on the sides. And this one was $12.99 and it's like that yarn fabric. Just like the gray sweater, I found the same one in beige. Again with the zipper, the pockets, and it's hoodie. And this was also $14.99. Oh, and then next are these super comfy pants. I was actually talking to my mom when I was at the store and I was looking for like the yoga pants that I showed you guys and then this lady overheard me because I was telling my mom like oh I think the last thing I need to look for is like the yoga pants and then this lady overheard me so she was like oh well there's some right here they're really nice and she showed me and they were very cute because they're like warm and they're boot cut they're very soft and they're very like warm from the inside and these were $6.99 and then this is the same as the black cardigan I got. The same thing, it's just that this one is beige and unfortunately this one doesn't have any pockets. And this was $11.99. And then next is a shirt that's kind of similar to like the orange one I showed you guys. Only this one is like, it's not like a thicker material. This one is thinner and it's like that material that's kind of cold on your skin. But I got it because I really like the color and this one was $7.99. I don't know, what do you guys think? I'm kind of like 
Maybe it needs to shrink more. I don't know. Maybe I'm returning it. This is also a sweater I got that I forgot to mention. And it is a Calvin Klein. And I like how it's very discreet. Because most of the time, sometimes they have like this big ass logo like right here or something. But it's very discreet. It's under the hoodie. And it just has it like on the little zipper over here. I thought it was going to be like those annoying hoodies that doesn't have any pockets. But this one actually does. So now let me try it on for you guys now disclaimer this is actually the one that i got from my sister because mine is dirty that's the one i used to come back with so this is a medium the one that i got was a small and it also has these like little things at the bottom and my sister has them like really tight but you can zip them all the way out and it could make it more loose on you if you want or just pull the little strings to tighten and this is what it looks like with the hoodie yeah this is exactly why I got a small <laughs> but look how cute this looks and it's very warm and next are these gingerbread pants which I found very cute perfect for pajamas the only thing that I kind of don't like is like this little cuff at the bottom and then I make sure to go like this because I hate when the bands are like too thick and like they're too like tight like when I go to sleep I want to be comfortable I don't want something like suppressing my tummy or anything you know but yeah I got it because they're very cute and they're pink a few minutes later I'm kind of let down from these not gonna lie the bow is I mean well, it comes in a bow, but I kind of like loosened it so I could like stretch the band. Ugh, I don't really like it. Like, I should have gotten a large, <laughs> even though it would have been a little bit longer. But even like, like on my feet, like I can notice it. Like, it's not even touching my feet. It's like right above, like on my ankles. And I don't like that it's like too tight. Like, I do like the print and everything, but... Yeah, I'm probably gonna have to return this one. And then I also wanted to show you guys this bag. This bag I actually found at last minute. And it is a Tommy High Hellfire one. However you pronounce that. And this is just like my little Wanda Funko Pop keychain. I just put that one right there. I really like this one because this one I could use it for like on the daily, like for work and stuff. I really like how spacious it is. My purse is very messy right now so don't judge me you guys, but this is how it looks. It has like a lot of space, it has a zipper over here and it doesn't have a flap, like a little pocket on this side but that's fine because it gives me like more space. But look at all the stuff I could fit in there do the hand test so a folded wrist and like all the way almost to like my forearm area I guess and I like that it's black and it has like that shiny look to it I absolutely love the fact that it is a crossbody also so when like I'm in a hurry I could just grab it like this but then once I'm not in a hurry I could take the time to actually put it around myself like this and this bag cost me $28.99, but it was at a comparable value of $90, so I'm saving a ton. And I also remember going to the Ontario Mills mall one time. I remember walking into like the Tommy store because I saw like a display like on their window. And I was like, oh, I see my backpack. Let me see how much it is. I'm pretty sure you've seen like a bunch of these like in backpack form at Ross. And I remember a backpack that I had at the time that pretty much looks exactly like this but in the backpack form it cost their like 90 80 or something and i had gotten it at ross for like 20 something bucks so yeah and then unfortunately i couldn't include it in the video because it's still dirty um but there was also this very pretty like white cream shirt which was very warm and it had like a cowl neck and that one was 12.99 but anyways thanks for watching my uh my ross haul it's not the best way to like show you guys these clothes like this is like my first time like actually putting on clothes for you guys and showing them on me anyways i hope you guys could actually like see like the material on the clothes and if you find them at ross get them because they're cute i'm pretty pumped about these pants still because i really like the print on them but hopefully i could find them at my local ross and i could get them in large because they're very cute and i really want them for the winter anyways thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys on the next one bye